Hey guys, I recently made a video on package installed 1.0 running on 3.60. And as some of you guys suggested, I was indeed in IDU mode with this app here. It was homebrew made by XYZ. Um, if you get this homebrew, it will not have this icon. I just put that icon on because I do not like blank icons. But, um, first off, before I get into this video on how to get into IDU mode with your PS Vito, I just want to say that you must have, um, you you pretty much must have the update blocker on, because IDU PS readers will automatically down, download and install system updates. So that is bad because if you're longer using this, the only way to convert it back is with Hankaku and the latest update blocks Hankaku. So you'll be completely screwed. Um, it'll be, it'll be, it'll be stuck in, we'll be stuck in IDU mode, and there'll be no way to get it out. Also, I, um, highly recommend that you stay away from doing this unless you are absolutely certain that you know what you're doing. And I'm just gonna show you, uh, there, where it said I'm, I'm at the year's firmware, but I'm actually on 3.60, but if I go in here, it says it's the latest firmware, and that's because I've got update blocker. Um, like I said, update blocker, this is one of the mo only times it's actually useful at the moment, but yeah, so this is, let's just get into it, okay? To enable demo mode, let's just open this. Alright, oh crap, we gotta have Hankaku on. Forgot about that, hang on, email. Gotta have Hankaku, forgot about the Hankaku pouch. Okay, let's just wait for that to exploit. Go. So yeah, guys, just look up the tutorial for the update blocker. Look up the tutorial for um, Hankaku, for Hankaku, and get just. It's up to you to find this homebrew. I'm not gonna give it to you um, because I do not actually want people to attempt this and yes, they know what they're doing. And people who know what they're doing will probably know where to get this homebrew. So anyway, it will see here. It will have give you uh, two options. Press. X to set IDU mode, press circle to kill IDU mode. If you want to enable it, just press X and it will enable and it will tell you to press any key to exit the application, so just do that. And then reboot your Vito and it will be in IDU mode. So, I'll just turn it back on. Mine isn't plugged in, so it will automatically turn itself off after f after uh, about, I think it's five minutes. If it's not plugged in, it will just turn itself off and then reboot and completely do that. As you can see, right now it's actually checking for software updates, and you'll see once it's in demo mode, it'll be like, dude, where's all my stuff? Um, don't worry too much about this. Um, just press start, and just hold start, push the up button. And then hold down the two L and L buttons. It's very hard for me to show this on camera. But if you hold down those buttons, it should. Damn it, this is really hard to show on camera. Okay. What you want to do is you want to hold down Start, Up, L, and L. Right? So hold those down for a few seconds. I actually don't know why it's not working. There we go. Okay, yeah. Just have to hold. Yes, try a couple times, and then everything will pair. Now on IDU mode, you have um, you have package install, and you can run it, and it will just work, right? As you can see, I'm currently not connected to a computer, so yep. Wholesale slash package is also available, but I don't think anyone knows really how to use that. Um, if you want to change back, you'll just run here and press circle, but well, you can't do that if you update, so don't yet it update, okay? Now in your settings, you will also have got, you will also have IDU, IDU settings, right, right there. 
Alright, and this is sort of a trim down thing. You can use the content downloader to download content and um, directly off the internet, like package files and stuff. You can change the circle button. You can sound output selection. You can make it go to the speaker or default. Wait time to start video playback. You can show PS4 link option if you want. You can format the memory card for pre installed media. I'm not quite sure what that means. Clean up unnecessary files, I'm not sure what that means. Um, you, can check, you can check memory card for games only, which I don't really know what that does. It does something. Um, last time I ran that, it actually started saying every single file on my memory card was corrupted. Let's see if it does that now. Yep. Um, so, yeah, if you touch those two check buttons, it will it will make everything in your memory card say file was corrupted. And you have to um you'll have to rebuild database, which is actually really annoying. I'm gonna have to do I'm gonna have to do that now. Um in order to get out of this. But yeah, that's that's IDU mode, that's how I did it, okay. That's how I got into shipping package install on 3.60. Thanks for this quick thank you for watching this quick video and I'll see you all later.